Hello everyone, in this video, I will be discussing some of the most important and most amazing shortcut tricks from units and dimensional chapter. In this video, I will be discussing shortcut tricks on two most important models asked from units and dimension. Those two important models are, first is, which among the following has same dimension? This is the most common question. If you look at the previous year question, you will definitely come across this question once in a while. Okay. Now, the second important question on which I will be discussing the shortcut tricks in this video is which among the following dimensional quantities are dimensionless? Which among the following are dimensionless quantities? In this way, they will be asking you the question. Now, in this video, I will be making you remember almost all the dimensional less quantities which you will come across in your class 11 as well as in your class 12 physics okay maximum i will be covering almost all the dimensional less quantities okay now let's not waste much time i'll uh, start with the trick now the first question as i told which among the following has same dimensions so in order to solve such type of question i have a simple trick for you just remember this word okay this word is very important P A I L pale now where you will come across this word pale pale pink pale yellow usually in you you'll come across this word in chemistry maybe in S block maybe in S block right you'll come across this in chemistry now what does this P denotes P denotes Planck's constant all right Planck's constant a angular momentum angular momentum i okay i'll be writing here impulse l as usual linear momentum because here we have angular momentum here we have linear momentum now this two quantities all right these two quantities and this two quantities have same dimensions it means the dimensional formula of angular momentum is same as so it means linear momentum as well as impulse have the same dimension suppose if you want to calculate i mean if you want to know the dimensional formula of angular momentum what is the formula for angular momentum m v r m means mass v velocity l t power minus 1 r is radius we can write it as l so if you multiply all m l square t power minus 1 this is the dimensional formula for angular momentum as well as this is the dimensional formula for Planck's constant similarly linear momentum p mass into velocity mass m velocity lt power minus 1 now this is the dimensional formula for linear momentum as well as impulse your question is solved next this is the most important trick the next trick now another trick trick number two i'll be giving you the word for relatives answer loudly now for relatives for relatives what does it mean we have to remember or we have to recall some four dimension which are having the word relative like relative permeability relative permittivity relative density then finally relative index these are the four relatives a n denotes angle and s denotes solid angle as simple as it is from a n you can remember angle just consecutive just next to a n s it means solid angle l loudly loudness 
loudness you can uh, we'll just come across this loudness in waves chapter in the 15th chapter maybe in class 11 15th chapter so four relatives answer loudly four relatives answer loudly four relatives answer loudly it's a simple trick now under this trick another trick we have i mean another mnemonics we have to me didi koi sp nahi to me didi koi sp nahi to me didi koi sp nahi okay now here i told four relatives then four relative permeability relative permittivity relative density relative index it in that way four quantities with relativeness it come so here i have written two then you have to guess there will be two quantities which contain m something with m so those two are mechanical equivalent of heat and megan mechanistic susceptibility this will come across in earth and magnetism in class 12 will come across this word all right but now the dielectric constant dielectric constant koi koi's co what you can guess coefficient of friction class 11 right coefficient of friction yes strain next p poisson's ratio this two quantities you will get in one chapter itself in mechanical properties of solids in class 11 you will get this two okay with nahi nothing just to complete the flow okay just to complete the flow we have two words four relatives answers loudly to me didi koi sp nahi four relatives these are the four relative we have to remember next a an angle yes solid angle loud loudness to me didi koi sp nahi to me there should be two with m two with m m m mechanical equivalent of heat magnetic susceptibility then didi 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 d dielectric constant koi koi co coefficient of friction sp strain and poisson's ratio nahi just to flow the sentence okay so i'll be bringing much more tricks and tips in all the subjects i mean physics chemistry biology and maths so do like share and subscribe thanks for watching have a good day